This is Dr. Frank Filiberto from Orthville Awakenings Cosmetic Surgery Center. We've had an issue that has occurred over the past month concerning a patient of ours that underwent a traumatic incident in which she actually was stabbed in her breast, right, in which this saline prosthesis protected and saved her life. Right? People basically want to know how can a saline prosthesis protect her life? Well, the, the reasons are twofold. Number one, this prosthesis is made up of a durable plastic polymer, right, which is guaranteed by the company for 10 years of survival. And number one, and number two, it's extremely pliable, right, and to be able to penetrate this and go through the saline would take a significant amount of force because it also has a giving, right. And then you also have to talk about the surgery that was involved in placing this prosthesis in. There are two ways to place the prosthesis in. There's two placements for this prosthesis. One would be under the breast, which is on top of the chest muscle, and the other place would be under the chest muscle, which is under the breast. Fortunately for this patient, she had it under the chest muscle, which is under the breast. So the knife had to penetrate not only the breast, but the chest muscle, and then penetrate this prosthesis, which was extremely pliable, filled with saline, which was difficult to get through. Although the knife did penetrate the prosthesis, it was not able to go through the back wall of the prosthesis, and the back wall of the prosthesis laid on her chest wall. So she was within, within a fraction of an inch of that penetrating her chest wall, which would possibly have collapsed her lung, or worse, penetrated her heart. So you can see that not only did the prosthesis all right, the prosthesis saved this individual's life, but also the placement of the prosthesis, which was not only under her breast, but under her chest muscle. So not only did it have to penetrate the breast, had to penetrate the chest muscle and the prosthesis before reaching. So we look at it as a situation in which, yes, this prosthesis did save this individual's life.